But I mean, in, in those six hours, I mean, how many games were hacked? At least six. I mean, not at least six. Oh, no way! I just got a triple collat. I just got a triple collat! Run. I just got a triple collat with the Springfield. No freaking way, man. Hello and welcome. My name is Kyle for the win and welcome back to another Call of Duty video. Today we are back with another return to video. And today, believe it or not, we are playing some World at War on the PC. We are playing some Plutonium. I think it's Plutonium TW4 or something like that. And I went and played this yesterday. Or I think it was actually Sunday. No! I think it was Sunday, actually, and I was just trying to see, going to see, because they added put, or aim assist onto World at War. Or they added aim assist onto Black Ops 2, Modern Warfare 3, and... Modern Warfare 3, or they added aim assist, sorry, on Black Ops 2 and Modern Warfare 3. So, I went to go check if they added aim assist onto World at War, and it actually turns out that they did add aim assist onto World at War, which is absolutely awesome. And means that I get to play some World at War on the PC. I mean, I would use keyboard and mouse, but I just... Wouldn't really be able to get you guys a good gameplay, but because, but because I, there's aim assist and controller, I can actually go for a really solid gameplay for you guys, which is really, really exciting, and I am very happy about it. So, dang it, that was an enemy artillery. So there are bots, as you guys can tell. Um, and that's because there is only one server that actually has players on World at War. But the fact of the matter is, is that I get to play World at War on the PC, which is just freaking awesome. And also, it's not like these bots are like, it's not like these bots are recruit. They're actually decently good. Like, I'm not going to lie. They're decently good. So we're not playing against, you know recruit bots just dominating we're, we're actually playing against bots that know what they're doing if you can even say that a bot knows what they're doing but as you guys can see i don't think this is going to go to a time limit so this is going to be a 23 minute video so we're going to switch up our weapon here in a second um we're going to use as many weapons as we can because i truthfully did not get to play or i've never gotten to play world at war like legitimately where it's not hacked, where we can actually just play it. No, I, I played Call of Duty 10 years ago, and by that point, World at War was already hacked to crap, so I didn't really have the opportunity to play. To play World at War, and so I just, let alone had good, good attachments and good weapons, in order to play World at War. So I'm just really excited to play this today. And we're on a nice 15 kill streak, which I guess I can't really brag about because again, we're playing against, we're playing with bots, but you know what? Who doesn't want to see World at War gameplay, right? Who doesn't want to see World at War super classic, super fun gameplay? I mean, I personally want to see World at War gameplay, even if I was watching someone play against bots. That's just me though. Okay, I want to call in the dogs, but I don't want to call them in until I die. And I died. Okay, let me switch my class real quick. I do have to switch between keyboard and mouse. I'm going to actually go for the Mosin. Go ahead and call those dogs in. I'm sure, I will buy, I'm sure I will die here pretty soon, so it's all good. Yep, there we go. 
All right, now let's do some snizzing and some sniping here. Oh my gosh, this is fun. This is so fun. No wonder people loved sniping so much. In this game back during World at War because... Oh my gosh. Because this thing, this is satisfying as hell. I'm not going to lie. This is like satisfying as all get out. Like, oh my goodness. Okay. Go in, dogs. Do your thing. No, he got me. See what I mean, though? The bots aren't stupid. They actually... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm dead. This game is so fun, though. I wish I could play against real players, but... You know what? This is just... This is just fun, man. Just running around. Snizzing. Also, it's kind of convenient that we're playing on Dome, because... Kind of, it's actually kind of convenient that we're playing on Dome because this map is going to be remastered into be remastered into World at War or and uh, Vanguard. So kind of convenient that we're playing on this map. This map is going to be the shipment equivalent. I just know it. You're going to run into all the all the camo grinders on this map. But I hope all the audio is okay. I actually. This is my first recording on PC. So I don't know um, if it's too loud or whatever. So hopefully everything sounds okay. Oh no. Beautiful. Nice. Should we go for a quick, quick scope? Okay. Oh, let's go! That man got destroyed. Um, let's call that in over there. Oh no. Nice! There's dogs. Oh, quick scope. Oh no, we died. Okay, uh, let's switch weapons here. Let's use the M1A1 carbine. I'm pretty sure this weapon doesn't have a fire rate cap. Or maybe it does. Huh? It does not have a fire rate cap. You guys get to see you get you guys get to see the Kyle for the win trigger finger. Okay. Never mind. There's one guy. Go ahead and reload this thing. This thing does have a fire rate cap in zombies, but not in multiplayer, which is weird. There it is. Can I call my dogs? No, they're not available. Oh, it actually looks like there is a time limit. There. Oh my gosh, this thing is monstrous. No wonder you got this thing at the last level in, the, in multiplayer. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What is this weapon? What is this weapon? Oh my... Oh my goodness. This thing rocks. Oh my god. Oh my god. If you guys can't tell, this is why I wanted to make a video on this. Oh, this is so freaking fun. This is just so fun. Is the score 300? Looks like the score limit is 300. This weapon shreds, man. Oh my goodness. Oh. Nice. Okay. See, this, this game goes to prove that you don't need a whole bunch of stuff to have a fun Call of Duty game. Like, I mean, I understand Call of Duty has to, you know, Call of Duty always has to change. But... Or in a, and, you know, change the new environment, but the way that Call of Duty has been lately, anyways. 84 and 19 gameplay there. Hopefully you guys enjoy... 
enjoyed that. I really want to play one more game. So I think we're going to go ahead and play one more game now that, I, now that I know there actually is a score limit. And I will see you guys all in gameplay number two. All right, guys, and welcome into game number two. We are playing some TDM on the map CeeLo. Hopefully we can do well, which is one of the largest maps in Call of Duty history. I didn't really want to play this map, but I have heard that this is one of the greatest maps ever in Call of Duty history. Well... We'll see. We're, we're starting off here by doing some snizzin with the Springfield. Okay, this is not a good place for me to be. No, I missed. Darn it. But we actually joined a server that actually has real players in it. The server that I mentioned earlier, I wasn't able to access when I started recording, but now I can, so... We're actually playing against real players now, which is awesome. So we'll, s we'll see how we can do. I'm going to... It's, it's kind of hard to see people. There's someone there. We might be doing a big old sniping video or a big old sniping gameplay here darn it see some i mean sometimes it feels like the aim assist is is sometimes it feels like it's there and then other times it feels like it isn't there so i mean i think that it I mean, it definitely is there because I would have missed that shot if I didn't have aim assist, I think. What? Okay, let's just go ahead and reload real quick. I mean, we might I might switch back to the Mosin here in a little bit. I want to rock with the... want to rock with the Springfield for now. Because I was using this sniper last night. And I was having so much fun with it. Okay, that was so lucky. Ooh. That was a nice shot. I still want to... My aim... My... My... Sensitivity is so low, man. I can't kill that guy. Oh my goodness. Wow, fair enough. I want to see this. Oh, it was a different guy. Never mind. It was a different guy. I thought it was... I thought... The guy that I was aiming at killed me. But nope. It was someone else. Who was really far away from me. Nice. Oh, okay. I guess we have dogs. Yeah, again, I hope everything is not too loud. If it is, I do apologize. This is basically a test video for the next time I play World at War on the PC because it, I will be playing this again. One, like 1,000%. Oh, Okay, all these guys seem to be over here. Or maybe they're even further back. They're further back. Oh, no, no, no. Why do I didn't mean to reload. I am a bot. Forget. Forget that I'm a bot. <laughs> that was some. Um... Hello. There we go. There we go. There's, there's a guy right here. Hold on. Oh my gosh, this Magnum is. I am loving this game. Oh my gosh. I can see why people absolutely adore this game. 
I am having like the most fun I've ever had in Call of Duty, like almost period. This game is just so freaking fun. Bad shot. Terrible shot. Okay, dogs. Okay, save kills for someone else. Uh oh, that is a grenade. And I have literally no ammo. Hold on. My teammates' dogs are just... That was a nice shot. My teammates' dogs are just killing everything. I mean, a, a simple game... Turn... I mean, this is just a simple game. A simple concept. And it is done perfectly. Like, it is just so fun. Now, I know that this isn't 20... I know this isn't 2008 World at War, but... It's still incredibly fun. I'm not gonna lie. It still is incredibly fun. Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to the... Mosin once I die. Dang it, my sensitivity is so low. Okay, my teammate got that guy. So these guys are all the way back over on the other side. I'm going to run over, all the way over there. Tw 12 and 5, not bad. We're keeping a 2KD gameplay here with the sniper. Our team has dogs again. I think should be screwed. Huh? Okay, let's go ahead and switch over to the Mosin. That was some weird accuracy. I don't know why that why those shots weren't registering. There we go. No, get down. Okay, Mosin time. I don't know. Do I like the Mosin better? I don't know. We'll find out. I think... I, I, I honestly think that, if I remember right, I think from a Chaos video I watched, I think the... All of the bolt-action snipers in World at War all have the same damage profile. They just have different handling speeds, I guess. And obviously different animations as well. And I got sniped by that guy again. I'm not going to go over there again. I almost ran right back to the same spot. Nope, 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 nope. Not going to go back over there. Dang it. My teammates are beating me to the kills. No. I saw that guy too. Come on. Come back here. Thank you. There we go. Nice. Nice! There we go. I wish my sensitivity could be higher. But I, I don't know how to... I don't know how to make it higher. All I know how to do is just snipe. Hit marker. That's my first hit marker. Nice. No! I saw that guy as well. Uh, 20... Okay, come on. Let's try and get three kills without dying. Nice. 
Dang it. No, they're all behind me. They all started to spawn behind. This is absolute insanity. Like, holy crap. Darn it. Ooh. I will take that. See what I mean, though, about the aim assist? There definitely is aim assist. I just don't know how effective it is. Or anything like that. But it's definitely there. But that's going to pretty much do it. 24 and 15. Not really the best gameplay ever. But you know what? This isn't about gameplay. This is just all about fun. And I think I'm going to go ahead and say that that's a gameplay. And... <laughs> Wow, these guys got destroyed. Well, there we go, guys. 24 and 15 gameplay there. Not anything too amazing there, but I did have a lot of fun, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video as well. If you guys did, like me, it's always appreciated. If you want to check out any of my other, any of my other return to videos, they will all be linked down below within the description, as well as my previous episode will be at the end of the video as well. And if you guys want to ever see any more World at War gameplay, just let me know, and I'll see you guys all on another Call of Duty video very, very soon. <laughs>